Hi, welcome back to our channel T4 T. So, as you all know, four months before we have uploaded a video on K Rail. So, if you haven't watched that, watch it. And today, I'm with the latest updates of K Rail. K Rail is a semi-high speed railway system coming up in Kerala, which connects Trivandrum to Kasaragod. In this video, I'm going to be explaining about the Silver Line, its facilities, its fare, comparison with the existing ones, and Roro service. So, as you all know, the fastest train in the world is the Shanghai Maglev in China, which has a high speed of 431 km per hour. And the fastest train in India is the Vande Bharat Express, uh, which has a high speed of 180 km per hour. And the Ske Rail has a high speed of 200 km per hour which, and an average speed of 132 km per hour which is faster than the Vande Bharat Express. Now if we take a train from Trivandrum to Kasaragod, we can reach there in 12 hours. And if we take the fastest train in that route but which is the Rajdhani Express, we will reach there in 9 hours at uh, 15 minutes. And by road, it will take 13 hours to 14 hours. And in K Rail, we can reach Trivandrum to Kasaragod in just 4 hours. Recently only, the Cochin Airport station is added. Thus, the total number of stations is 11 now. Feeder services are also there, which connect in between places. K Rail is under the Kerala Rail Development Corporation Limited. Kerala Rail Development Corporation is a public sector joint venture company under the ownership of Government of Kerala and the Ministry of Railways. These are the current board members. Silver Line The path on which the K Rail travels is called the Silver Line, which has a length of 529 km and which connects Trivandrum to Kasaragod. And it uses the standard gauge line, which is 1.43 meter. In every 500 meter, there will be uh, over bridges or under passages. And it also connects all the four international airports, which is Trivandrum, Cochin, Calcutt and Karnur. And this path is double lined, which is up and down. And the land needed for, this, uh, for the construction of the silver line is... 1,226 hectares and the buildings to be evacuated for the construction would be 9,000 and 20 to 25 meter land width is required for the rails. About the trains. The trains will have 9 AC bogies of 2 classes business class and standard class and could accommodate 645 travellers. The estimated travellers per day is 68,000 people. In peak hours, there will be a train in every half an hour. 50,000 people will get jobs during the construction and 11,000 people will be recruited for the service. Expenses The total expense of the project is 64,000 crores. About 50% loan from foreign countries 12% from central government, 25% from state government and 13% from in internal loans. The fare of tickets from Trivandrum to Kasaragod is 1,405 rupees and now in 3rd AC in Rajdhani Express it costs 1,205 rupees. And the cost of this ticket from Trivandrum to Ernagulam in K Rail is about 550 rupees. And we can reach there in 1 hour 40 minutes. Roro service. Roro means roll on, roll off. Where loaded trucks are directly carried by railway wagons to their destination. Roro service will be an auxiliary service to the K rail. Its advantages are truck transportation becomes faster. That means from Trivandrum to Kasaragod from 16 hours to 6 hours. Due to K rail Roro service, 500 trucks are per day is shifted from road to rail. Thus, the diesel consumption and the po uh, pollution uh, decreases. The railway line aims to ease transportation congestion between the northern and southern parts of the state. 
also improving travel times and protect climate change. Hope your the video was informative for you. If it was informative, please share the video and like it. And if you want more videos like this, subscribe our channel. Thank you.